welcome back to another video guys so in this video um, I will show you how to fix the auxiliary water pump um, so you'll get this fault obviously you'll not get any engine light or any warning or anything on the dash on the cluster should we say all that does the auxiliary pump is when you switch it off it just kind of cools the table down so it's very common it's very very common in these um, I would probably call your main dealer first thing first to see if there's a recall on them because the majority of them are unfortunately this one isn't so i will show you how to get to it and um, it's about from the other it's about 60 quid 50 to 60 quid so it's not expensive on ebay probably 30 40 quid but i'd rather pay the extra and get the genuine so you're not gonna have the same fault and it's located here at the bottom here so what we have to do is take off these pipes take this away i'll show you step so by step you have a size 8 socket here take that one off this is size seven loosen them all so this can play freely we'll have to obviously empty the tank as well one of the pipes i'll have to undo it i'll show so you i can use a plier or something to squeeze this pull it back take this out so it doesn't because it's very flimsy it'll snap easy um and then we'll so just after take you it. just kind of lift it up this is kind of hooking onto it and then you've got this clip here so just using something where have I put it? I can't remember, but let's just use something to clip this out and then pull it down. So it that's out. Um, <coughs> obviously, I can just pop this, pop it here for the time being out of the way. This is again size 7. I'll take this off just so you've got room for your hand to go in and out because there it is. That's where it lives. So uh, I wasn't able to take this off, not into the wheel, so I've just pushed it against there. I have undone the cable. So as you can see, it's there. I've undone it. This is it. Literally a clip at the top, push, um, and then you've got, I'm just going to try out, there's the bolts there, there's a few on there, so I'm just going to uh, see what size is. eight. Um, that's one so of So we're them. underneath guys, so as you can see, there's that pipe, that'll need to come off, and then there's a few more bolts, but when you take that off, be careful because it's got a lot of um, coolant, that'll be emptied out, so... Just be very careful so there's this one at the top as well as you can see so i have used this all i need to do is just play about with it until it comes off so as you can see it's a lot of antifreeze and it's popping out and when you undo the other one it's going to pour out there's even. actually two screws on there no more one literally as you can see one on there further in and one there which just literally side by side is there as you can see it's them two screws, one there, one there, side by side, and then it becomes loose. And uh, yep, we just have to unhook that one there, the hose pipe, and we're good. Ta -da! I've got it now, guys. <laughs> so it stands literally like that. You've got this screw, and that screw, and this one, and this hose. I need to come off and you've got that so this is packed in internally it's probably corroded in terms of um the whole like i don't know electronic system of it and that's what causes it to kind of pack in um so this one the code for this oh god so hard to get let me see if i can clean it and give you a better idea of what what the code will be so here it is. Don't know if you can see that, guys, but. And some people out there will be like, ah, oh, you're not using a glove, but hey, yo. There you go. That's the code for it. Like I said, dealers, uh, well, they said 50 summit quid, 57, 58, call it 60 in this sake. Um, and uh, eBay's probably, four, I've seen it for 43 quid, 45. But yeah. I mean, time does change and the money does go up and down at that time. So, but yeah, it's really easy to get to nothing. 